guys, hey guys, hey guys, welcome back. Welcome back to Tracy's Place. I have been waiting to do this tag all summer. Uh, I did a summer tag, but you all know summer's not my favorite season. Even though I enjoy doing that tag, I have been waiting to do this one. This one right here, because this is my favorite favorite season of the year. Um, I know a lot of people have been doing it. They did it like a month ago and I just thought that was a little too early. I wanted to do it actually at the beginning of fall. Um, it kind of reminds me of, you know, in the summertime when they start putting out the uh, trees and, you know, uh, Christmas trees and Halloween stuff like right in mid, -aug beginning of August. Man, I cannot <laughs> but anyway, I wanted to wait to do mine at the beginning of fall. So here we go. The first question is, I'm going to be looking up and down because I have my questions written out on paper. Um, autumn or fall? Do you call the season autumn or fall? I call the season fall. I know autumn was a bigger thing for some reason when I was little. I remember a lot of people calling it autumn, but fall is what... I've called it for years, and I hear a lot of other people calling it fall too, but I, I tend to go with fall. Second question, Halloween or Thanksgiving? Which one is your favorite holiday? I'm going with Thanksgiving because Halloween, I don't really celebrate it, um, even though um, mm, Halloween, I know it's not meant the same for everybody, but, you know, it started as like a pagan holiday or whatever, 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 whatever. But I still sometimes like Halloweenish type things. I like uh, the trick-or-treating and, you know, different things dealing with Halloween, like the candy, you know, all that stuff, the cute little costumes. But the meaning of Halloween, I can't get with, of course. But so Thanksgiving is my favorite one. Third question. What is your favorite fall movie? The Wizard of Oz. What else could it be? <laughs> the Wizard of Oz. I have loved The Wizard of Oz since I was little, of course, like many people. Um, but yeah, I used to watch it every year. And I think I probably stopped about 10 years ago or something like that. But it will be my, my favorite movie to watch like every year. But I just don't see it coming on that often. I don't know if my head's just in the sand or I'm just stuck up in YouTube or whatever, but I haven't seen it in probably a couple of years. So I'm going to find it this season though, because that's my favorite fall movie. Number four, what is your favorite scary movie of the fall? Hmm. I don't just love scary movies, although I do get in those different um, feelings of where I want to be scared just a little bit. And Halloween has got to be the one. Okay. Halloween 2018. All right. And I have not seen it yet. But Halloween 2018 is the movie that I'm going to watch this year because when it was out last year, I wanted to go to the show and see it just because of the nostalgia of it. Jamie Lee Curtis. Oh my goodness. She started with the Halloween franchise years ago when it first started. I don't know if it was 1978 or something like that, early 80s. When Halloween first came out, and I think she was in every one, if I'm not mistaken, but she is just a classic in that movie, of course, just a classic movie, and I do like jumping and being scared, you know, and all that stuff, so I would have to say Halloween 2018, and I'm going to see it this year. <laughs> all right, uh, question number five, what is your favorite fall scent? I'm going to have to go with Harvest Apple. Um, I know a lot of people like spiced apple, which that smells good, but I like more. I like fresh scents. So I like apple for fall. So I just kind of go with a harvest apple. Not like something bright and springy, but like a good, deep, mm, a rich apple smell. I'll say that with just a little hint of freshness. Yeah, I like that. Number six, sweet potato pie or pumpkin pie? Sweet potato pie all day long. Even though I can't eat most of them because of the egg thing, but I can make eggless sweet potato pies, and I just love sweet potatoes now anyway. I used to didn't when I was coming up, but I like them now, so I have to go with the sweet potato pie. And if you throw some, um, what do you call it, pecans and the little thing that they do with it on top of it, even better. Number seven, favorite fall drink. Spiced apple cider, flavored coffees, 
teas or hot cocoa? I'm going with hot cocoa. I love hot chocolate in the fall. I love it in the winter too, so it's probably going to be my favorite drink still for the winter. But I love it for the fall, especially getting into like late October, early November when the weather is really changing even the more. So I like hot cocoa and my second would be the spiced apple cider. All right, number eight, haunted house, haunted hayride, or corn maze. Well, I don't want to do anything haunted. Uh, so I'm going to go with the hayride, though, but just not a haunted hayride. I want to go, I've been on one, you know, in school years ago when they take you on those day field trips and they had the hayrides for fall and stuff like that. So I've done one of those, but I would love to go on one with my husband. So maybe I look into doing that as a date, a surprise date night. Maybe we go for a hayride. Mm -hmm. uh, corn maze, that sounds fun. So you probably have to find somewhere out kind of like outside of the city limits to go to a corn maze. And I know some people might not know what that is, but I know it's prevalent more so here in the Midwest and places that grow corn. Um, and you, they just cut a path out in the, in the corn, the actual corn stalks that you eat. They cut mazes out in the field. You have to find your way through, find your way back. All right. Number nine, favorite Halloween candy. Anybody that knows me knows it is the Reese's pumpkin. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. The Reese's pumpkin, even for the winners, anytime. That's just my favorite candy. Period. I don't need to be eating it, but the Reese's pumpkin, uh, Christmas time is the Christmas trees, Easter time is the Reese's egg. So Reese's, Reese's pumpkin. All right, number ten. What is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Okay, for years I never, never, never liked Thanksgiving food. Now this is when I was little. Coming up, me and my cousin Coretta used to call it beige food because we'd go over one of my auntie's house and it just, just seems like all the food was beige or those just mute colors and it just did not appeal to me or appeal to us, me and my cousin. And we would talk about Thanksgiving and we would travel to Cleveland most of the time for Thanksgiving because that's where most of my relatives were from. And we'd go up there and my aunt would have Thanksgiving. Me and my cousin would hit up Burger Now, mostly everything was closed, but certain things stayed open until a certain time. <laughs> Me and my cousin, <laughs> that's how silly we were back in the teenage years, y'all. Back, back, back. We hit up Burger King, get our favorite uh, bacon, double cheeseburger, fries, and a Sprite or orange. We'd be good. We'd go to my auntie's house and just get a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of that. <laughs> but yeah, so anyway, now my my taste buds have uh, enlightened and, and come around and everything. And I love Thanksgiving food. And as y'all know, with my egg thing, there were so many things that has eggs in it back then. People just was not substituting back in the day. Um, but now people can substitute or just leave it out. They've found that they can do that. Um, so you have dressing without the eggs in it, um, macaroni and cheese without eggs. So I, I, I do all of that now, thank my Lord, and I love it. But my favorite has to be candied yams. Mm -hmm. Candy yams. And a good one with the pecan, like I said, with the pecan. I go with the pecans, but pecans in it and stuff. Mm. Good, good, good. But yeah, candy yams is my favorite Thanksgiving food. Number 11, what is your favorite thing about fall? Mm. Mm. I got several answers. Okay. First thing is the weather getting cooler. Oh, my goodness. I love the brisk feeling. I don't, not when it gets cold now. I ain't going in the winter. I just mean the fall. Just the, and the air is fresher. And the, just the cool breeze. Oh, my goodness. I just love fall. The cool weather. I love cool weather. I love to bundle up and just feel, mm. so it has to be the weather getting cooler. Um, the leaves changing. I love when the leaves change colors. It's the beautiful. The burgundies, the burnt oranges, the browns, and you know, all that. Gorgeous. Uh, let's see. Oh, you can open the windows. You can open the window. Summer is too muggy where I live. It is humid and the weather is just ugh, in the summertime. But in the fall, you can open those windows, and especially at nighttime, oh my goodness, and I just move even closer to hubby and just, it's, it's 
leaving them windows open. Fall festivals. Fall festivals when they have the vendors with all of their wares, like if they're selling jewelry, shirts, um, whatever, um, crafts and stuff like that. And uh, they also have food, like food trucks or vending tables with foods and stuff. I just, I love fall festivals. All right, number 12. Dark nails or neutrals. I like dark for fall. Mm -hmm. This is one that I just did last night. And um, it's like, I'm a mixologist, y'all. Y'all know with ev with everything, more than y'all know. <laughs> but I mix this polish. I mix my polishes all the time and come up with custom colors. This is a, uh, was actually this color in the nail polish bottle. I put a little bit of, well, I put a lot of brown in it. And it came up with this orangey, well, not orangey, this reddish brown color. And I love it. I don't know if you can see it, but I love this color. So, yeah, I'm a mixologist, y'all. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Number 13. Thigh highs or ankle boots? Well, y'all, I'm going to go with the ankle boots because I think thigh highs is just a little tacky. <laughs> I just don't think they're cute at all. They just remind me of, you know. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to go with ankle boots. 14. Candy apple or caramel apple? Caramel apple all day long. Candy apples, as I remember, I haven't had one in a long time, but I did not care for them because now the taste, the flavor is good, but the stickiness, um, it's like that hard stickiness, and it gets in your teeth, and you have to or get something to pick it out, and I don't care for that at all, but caramel apple is kind of sticky too, but it's a good sticky, and it's manageable, it's chewable, and you can, mm, and it tastes good. Back in the day and growing up, I had to have nuts on it, but now I kind of like them plain. Just a caramel, a good caramel apple. So, yeah. 15. Do you like, which months do you like best? Or which month do you like best? October or November? Ah, they both almost neck and neck. I love November, but October edges it out just a little bit because... November is getting towards winter, even though we don't have a much of a fall anymore like we used to years ago. The seasons is kind of like, we get a short fall and a short spring. But anyway, October, I think is my, well, it is. I say October um, because it's a cool briskness. It's not cold yet. So I just love that just putting on a long sleeve shirt or either even just a sweater or a jacket is good with me. I'm not ready for the coats yet. So October has to be my favorite. 16. Uh, let's see. My favorite. What is your favorite fall treat? S'mores. S'mores or s'mores or whatever you want to call it. That's my favorite thing. It's nothing better. Now, <laughs> We've kind of gotten away almost from going outside, building a fire and all that good stuff. But I can do it right on a gas stove. And even though I don't have a gas stove, I have electric, um, you could do it with a match and just burn, you know, or what do you call it? I forget what you call them things. That's um, a lighter. Do it a lighter or something like that and just burn your, your uh, marshmallows. You know, and put them on that chocolate, put that graham cracker on, and you good to go. You good to go. We do them like that all the time in the house. Um, let's see. What is your favorite fall clothing item? Um, I would have to say a sweater. Like these button-up cardigans. I love those. I think they're so cute for fall. Um, I even like a little cute beanie. So I'm gonna, I think I might try to get into that. They're, they're real cute. I've worn them a few times, but I see other people with them on, and they're so cute. But a cute beanie hat. Uh, let's see. Favorite fall color, burnt orange. I love burnt orange. And orange is not like a favorite color of mine, but for fall, I just I love the burnt orange. Uh, and, and that, like, um, orangey red. I love that, too. Love that, too. 19. Do you like... To decorate for fall and I would have to say I don't decorate the inside of my house because okay I'll say it like this my decorations basically stay standard until 
Christmas time. Christmas time, I decorate. That's the most I go all out is for Christmas. If we're having something for fall, like Thanksgiving, if we're hosting Thanksgiving in the family, whatever, I put out Thanksgiving de decorations, which is fall leaves and pumpkins and stuff like that. I'll do that. Um, but decorating the inside of my house, my house, as y'all can see, is already fall colors. Uh, this is my spread that stays on <laughs> all the time. I'm not one that changes out my bathroom and stuff like that, but I think I'm going to start. I think I'm going to start changing, like even just doing spring, summer, and then do a fall, winter. Decorate, have two decorations for the year and just leave it at that. Let's leave it at that. But I do decorate my yard each season. Um, sp spring and summer just kind of blends together. But for fall, like y'all see, I'll, tag, I'll link it at the end of this video. I decorated my yard for fall. And then um, definitely, you know, do the Christmas decorations inside and out. Uh, let's see. Last question, number 20, is... What is your favorite fall weekend getaway spot? Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Oh my goodness, you all. If you all have not been to Gatlinburg, uh, you want to get there. If you are anywhere kind of on the east side of the United States, um, and if, if you don't mind traveling, just get, it is beautiful. Oh my goodness, in the fall, the leaves, because it's so it's so much green down there, and the leaves are changing in like October. Oh my goodness, we used to go down there all the time with my family. My father loved going to Gatlinburg, Tennessee, and I love going to Gatlinburg, Tennessee now. Um, we don't do it often. I think the last time we went was like two years ago, two or three years ago. But it is a beautiful place to go. There's so much to do, and in fall, the weather is nice, and like I said, the fall leaves are changing. It's beautiful. It's nice to go with your family or your boo. <laughs> yeah, it's wonderful. It's a wonderful place to go. All right, you guys. So that is it for my fall favorites or this fall tag. I hope you enjoyed it. Please feel free to do this tag. Uh, let me know if you did. That way I, I want to come and see, you know, your tags too. Because I'm looking at the different fall tags. But if you've done this one, let me know. And I would definitely come and watch you. All right. Love you guys. Have a blessed day and enjoy this fall. Bye.